Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the video. It's an absolute pleasure to use one of the greatest ever center backs that ever played the game. Franco Baresi, Paolo Maldini, the, the Kaiser, Franz Beckenbauer are all names well known to people as the greatest center backs. Those people who think, who think Van Dijk is the best center back, they are fully deluded. These guys were head and shoulders above Van Dijk when it comes to defending. Now, when you look at this card, he probably doesn't have the best prerequisites of a fantastic centre-back. He's 5'9", medium-high work rates, which are very good, don't get me wrong, that's fantastic. But yeah, this card was incredible at centre-back. His interceptions, his jockeying, incredible. I would say the only negative to this card, he's not the strongest centre-back, and I do like my centre-back strong. He's not an auto centre-back. He's definitely somebody you want to use manually. And another thing, he doesn't have that massive presence. And so basically, he doesn't get the AI order blocks. Or, you know, sometimes I've seen the ball go through his legs. Or he wasn't the best at deflecting the ball when the striker was taking a shot. But when it comes to raw defending, this guy and Cannavaro, I mean, if you like your manual center backs, they are incredible. This guy, his, his interceptions, his stun and slide tackle are so perfect. When it comes to defending, actually, you don't even need to use the shadow chemistry style. You could go with the catalyst instead. You could go with the anchor because his defending is so good. It's like high 90s for everything. His interceptions, his passing as well was really good. He felt good on the ball as well. Good agility, good balance. But like I said, I love this passing because I do want a centre-back that can pass. Because a lot of the players, they have this tactic where it's pressure. It's like press after possession loss. And they just put a lot of pressure on you. And it's nice to have a centre-back like him. Yeah. Don't get me wrong. This is not 100% not, not the best centre-back that I've used. But I like what EA have done here. Because people look at Baresi and think, oh, what an ugly card. 95 rated card. And it kind of tells you what type of player this guy was. Up there as one of the greatest centre backs. And yeah, like I said, I wanted to show you this because actually he wasn't the best at deflecting. You know, like the way Desai, Van Dijk, Rio Ferdinand, Laurent Blanc, Lucio, these kind of really big centre backs. These are the guys, kind of guys I like. But I have a nephew that, look at that slide tackle right there to stop the ball from going at the back of the net. I've got a, a nephew who's really good at manual defending. I think if you like your manual defenders, I think you'd really like this card because he is rapid. He's got a fantastic reactions. And to be f something that surprised me, he's really good in the air. He won the ball a few times from headers against strikers that were quite frankly a lot taller than him but yeah overall Franco Baresi incredible center back do I think he's worth the 400,000 not really I don't think he's worth 450,000 coins no but he is one of the greatest ever center back and I'm happy to give him a 9 out of 10 thank you very much for watching